Hi guys. A simple little repair, I hope. I noticed this ESC has a habit of turning itself on and off regardless of what the on-off switch is doing. I've got it temporarily wired up just so we can see what I mean. I've got a battery there and I've got my servo tester there. That just glows with a bright blue LED when it gets switched on, so that's quite handy to see. So, what should happen is you turn it on and you'll see the ESC is flashing, the red LED on that, and my servo tester is turned on. And if I turn it off, it should turn off. But quite often I've noticed that it turns itself back on again. And it's quite simple. The wires just here are touching either side of the switch. I don't know if the camera will pick that up if I bring it up really close. You see it's a real mess just there. So I'm going to fold the heat shrink back so that I can just re-solder it. And that should be it. Done. Well, I was going to desolder the wires, but the black one's fallen off anyway. Let's see if I can get my soldering iron in there. A little bit awkward to do it because we've got a big solder joint that it's lumped in with. There we go, that's off. Can we tidy up the other one as well? Yep, yeah, done that. Right, I have to redo these. Retin them. See that shorting out anyway. Must be a bit of spare wire. It's not a very easy place to get to without stripping all the heat shrink off. And I haven't got any more of that size, so... I'm trying to save it. It's not doing very well. I'm overheating it. Have to shorten that again. It would have been much easier if I'd have taken the old heat shrink off. on. How can we get in there and do this other one? Looks okay. Let the heat shrink back down over it. Plug it 
back in. So I'm surprised. That really was pretty poor design, so close to each other, in my opinion, which doesn't really count for much. I must buy some more big heat shrink so I can do that again properly if I have to do it again at some time. Job done. Just trying to hold it close to the camera so we can see. So it's the red and black wire on the far left hand side. Just remembered I've got this one that I took the heat shrink off because it actually burnt out. These two are burnt out and you can see all the melted plastic here. But these are the two wires we're talking about down here and you can see these are spreading across. So that's the two contacts for the on-off switch. <laughs> 